Hi, in this video, you'll be learning how to sort and filter your data. Sorting your data means to organize your data in a specific order. That could be numerically, alphabetically, in ascending order, or descending order. To filter your data is to create displays for relevant information only. Slicing is another way to filter content. The benefit of adding a slicer is that it creates a nice button for you to filter with. Let's now take a look at an example. We'll be using this small data set of five cars. We have information about the make, model, year, color, price, and miles on the car. The data is currently in no particular order, but we can sort it to be in ascending order by price. That way, we know which car is the most affordable. To do that, we need to highlight the price data. To highlight the price data, we need to click on column E. This will highlight all of the data inside of that column. So now, we can sort our data by the price. First, we'll need to go to the data tab in the toolbar and select sort sheet. You also have the option to select only a portion of the data by selecting sort range. But for now, we want to sort the entire sheet. Lastly, we are given the option to sort the sheet by column E from A to Z, which is ascending order, or Z to A, which is descending order. This will still work for us even though we're dealing with numbers and not words. For our case, we'll need to select sorting from A to Z. Great, now our data is sorted by price in ascending order. Let's now add some filters. To add filters, you want to highlight all of the data that you want to filter. Next, go to data again, and this time select create a filter. You will now notice these filter symbols next to each column that you selected to filter. We can now create custom filters in order to view only the data that we want to see. Let's say we want to only see cars that have less than 20,000 miles and were made in 2019 or later. First, you'll need to click on the filter button next to the year column. Then, for this filter, we can use the filter by values option. This allows us to use all of the current values in the column to filter by. They're all listed down here at the bottom. And since we want cars that are from 2019 or later, we can deselect 2018. Our data now only includes cars from 2019 and up. Lastly, let's create a filter for the mileage. This time, we'll click on the miles filter, and then we'll select filter by condition. We then need to click on this drop down menu and select less than or equal to. Now in the text box, we can enter, we can enter 20,000 since we want cars that have no more than 20,000 miles. Okay, now we can go back to our data set and we see that all of the cars are from 2019 and up and none of them have more than 20,000 miles. The cars are also still sorted in ascending order by price. Great. Now, what if we wanted to see all of our data again? We would need to remove the filters. To do that, you can just go to the data again and then select remove filter. Now all of the cars pop back up. Let's now take a look at how we can add a slicer filter. This time, we'll go to the data tab and then select add a slicer. Next, we need to select the column we wish to slice. For our slicer, we'll choose color. This now gives us a button that we can use to filter our data based on color. By default, all of the colors are being shown and none are being filtered out yet. That is why we see all towards the right of our slicer. By selecting all, it will expand all of the different values we can filter by. Let's say we want to filter out the white cars. We want to make sure we select filter by values and then we can deselect white. Now, if we go back to our data set, it no longer has any white cars. Now, to remove a slicer, you need to click on the three dots and then select delete slicer from the pop-up menu. Our data is now fully on display again. It's important to remember that filtering and sorting does not delete any data, so don't be afraid to experiment. Now it's your turn to practice sorting your data and adding filters.